Hello everyone, this is Joel, the EV Geek Studios podcast, and we are here with Paul and Jason from EV Charge It and Diagnostics. Diagnostics. So, uh, Jason, tell us a little bit about this mobile EV charging unit you guys have here. Uh, so basically what it is, mm -hmm. is a generator with a home-based charger. And we can, we can show up at any location, mm -hmm. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and get you charged up enough to get you to the next charging station mm -hmm. or home. Gotcha. So, and so what kind of, what do you, what, what's kind of output are you getting on this device here? Uh, that would be a great question yeah. for Paul. He's our technician. Paul, what kind of, what kind of output you get on this device? Though? Uh, you say it was like 48? Yeah, 48, yep. 40, 48, somewhere around there. Gotcha. 48,000. Now you said this was a, so this is a specially designed generator, correct? Right. Mm -hmm. Yes. Gotcha. And, uh, uh, you said you got two of these up and running right now? We do. We've got one here in central Arkansas. We have one in northwest Arkansas. And coming soon, we will be covering the Memphis area. Gotcha. So I noticed that you were showing me, uh, I believe, Paul, that it runs off an app. So how does the app work exactly? We don't have to start up right now. Because how does the app work exactly to operate this? Well, it's um, Wi-Fi and uh, hotspot. It runs okay. off a hotspot. Okay. And all you just got to... Download the app on the phone, and uh, it just connects with the uh, hotspot, okay. and you control everything with your phone with that app. Will this work without that app? No. No. So you have to have that. It's right. like a security feature. Correct. Almost. Gotcha. So mm -hmm. someone someone can't see you in a parking lot. Pull this out, hit the button, and plug it. Right. No. Gotcha. Gotcha. So what made y'all start doing this? Because I believe you started with you were still in the towing business, correct? Yes. So we're still in the towing business. So what made you kind of get started with the with the EV charging units? Uh, so there's a need. Yep. Uh, to tow an EV is a is not always the safest thing to do. There's so much. If you don't have a specially trained technician, tow truck driver that knows how to handle an EV, you can do a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. uh, if you tow it, you can actually energize it and put and and when you're pulling it up on the truck, there's damage. There's special equipment that's required, special training for every model. The safest way to move an EV is under its own power. So you get out somewhere, you just don't weren't paying attention, your battery dies, or you don't have you know you're not gonna make it to the charging station or make it home. We can come out and get you enough to get you there. That's that what this machine is designed to do. So it's not designed for someone if they need to go from zero to 100%. No. It's designed where I need 20 miles, I need 15 miles, I need 30 miles. Let's get you to that point. Exactly. Get you on your way. Exactly. Right. Awesome. It's, it's emergency service. Yep, so I noticed this is the, the CCS. You do have the Tesla adapter to go with it. Yes, sir. It's right here oh, yeah, I've got the Tesla yep. adapter to go with it, too. So, God, so how many times, that, so how, how long have these units been up and running and functional in Arkansas? In Arkansas, we are the first company. Gotcha. Now, uh, Texas, there is a, a company in Texas that actually designed the unit uh, that they've been doing it for a couple of years. Uh, they've been very successful with it. Their customers absolutely love it. There's also a gentleman in Las Vegas who is doing the same thing. He, all of these units come from the same supplier. And how long have you guys have, to have, have ugh, excuse me, how long have you guys had these up in operation? Uh, about two weeks. Oh, gotcha. So these are really new. Gotcha. These are brand you new. You already had to use it. We had a car in Northwest Arkansas. You we, had to, you we, had to we've already had to use it. Gotcha. So how do people know about you? So if they call and say, I need a tow, I have a Tesla, do you say, well, we also have this service to where we, uh, we, we are We are in the towing business, but mm -hmm. this company is actually a separate company from the towing business. Okay, gotcha. Uh, we, they can look, they can find us on Google, gotcha. on Facebook. Okay. And hopefully through you guys. Yep, we'll make sure we put all the information on our on our description as well. Um, but if someone does call, say Jay Hooks telling me, say, hey, I need a tow, I ran out of charge, they say, hey, we got we'll refer you over here, they yep. refer to you guys, you guys go. Yes, by. we can absolutely do that. So major question, what does a service like this cost them? <laughs> so it is an emergency service. Yes. Uh, it costs less than a tow. Got, okay. Uh, to plug the machine in, it's $125. Okay. If it's com that some some are going to be a lot easier than others. Mm -hmm. If the if everything is completely dead, including the 12 volt battery in yep. the the frunk, yep. 
Uh, we have the technicians that know how to get into that, know how to charge that. Mm -hmm. You have to do that to wake the yep. whole unit up yep. and then start charging. So it's $125 to hook up. Okay. And then it's a dollar a kilowatt. Okay. And then uh, depending on how far we have to go, mm -hmm. uh, if it's some, something fairly local, yep. uh, it, it's $2.50 a mile. Okay. So if you're five miles away, it's whatever I, I don't math that yep. well but you know uh, you, you, you know 10 bucks or something yeah it, 10, bucks, 10 or 12 dollars yeah. mileage yeah, two, so 250 a mile yep gotcha so um let me so look in here there's the, the power button you got a wi-fi button um you said you have two of these are they both on trucks like this both of your units yeah very similar yeah gotcha. Bo both on service trucks gotcha so what we're gonna do now i'm gonna let paul crank this up because it will get loud here uh, we'll pop the side, uh, we'll pop the port open over here and I'll go inside and let you know what kind of, what kind of information we're getting from the test of wild charging. So we'll see you here in a second. All right, so thank you all for that cool demonstration. How do people get a hold of you here in Central Arkansas if they need your service? So absolutely, Facebook, uh, we, we have a website and we also have our 24 hour service number, 877-387-9724. And we have EV Charge It Diagnostics, all right. Huge shout out, thank you, Jason. Thank you, Paul, for You're stopping welcome. by here at Evolve Auto to give us a little quick demo of how this works. This is another awesome service here for EV owners here in Little Rock, in Central Arkansas, and also Northwest Arkansas. And we want to thank you all for listening to another episode of the EV Geek Podcast. So long, everyone.